What's up everyone? <laughs> Today I'm playing a horror game where you can only see if you speak. And if you don't speak, you don't see. But also if you do speak, you can die. You are basically a blind person walking through a realm where sound is what gives you the ability to view your surroundings. However, there are also enemies to where if they hear you make those sounds, they will fucking kill you. And it's quite terrifying. Uh, right now, we're just starting it. And this is called Stifled by Sony Interactive Entertainment. Um, it's not the best game out there. You know, there's, there is better. There's a lot here that we can see and do. This is basically the opening segment here. A lot of what you see going on is basically completely irrelevant to anything. Um, I don't believe there's any type of collectibles or anything here that adds to the storyline. You know, the, uh, the, oh, there's a rubber dot. Those are always important. <laughs> uh, yeah, so, I mean, if I turn this off, I won't have sound and watch. If I just be quiet, you'll see the fog set in. And I'm essentially blind until I make noise again. Uh, so we will keep that faucet going. My footsteps also produce noise. Now, this is not even the game. This is just your starting area. Um, I'll be quiet here, and I will help make other noise so I can see. So you can see. This is actually a pretty ingenious way that they're utilizing the microphone into the game. And other than, I think, Astrobot, I haven't seen any other games tackle it like this. So it's actually pretty cool. But I'm going to shut up so you can watch some magic happen. So I use objects in my area to help produce more sound, which keeps the task of me always having to talk, uh, you know, not so burdening. However, like I said, this isn't a game. We're about to dive into a much different location where it, everything is drawn. Um, it kind of looks like black and white artwork. I did like this game for what it was. Yeah, see, there's some creepy shit. There's <laughs> that. This is that where that random basketball had bounced. There's some uh, weird items here. The three little pigs. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure of the significance of anything going on in here, to be honest with you. I, I don't think any of it has significance. I, I, I honestly I don't so, remember. So, so, what do you think we should name her? <laughs> Hold your horses. We don't even know the gender. <laughs> <laughs> That's an ugly looking child. There's this creepy fucking doll again. <laughs> Honey, come on, we're gonna be late for the party. Shh, it's just the neighbors, they're next door. Alright, that's not weird at all. Let's see if we can turn on the uh, stereo here. There we go. That helps me out with making noise so that I can see a little more freely. Here's the uh, dining room. Holy shit, that scared the fuck out of me. Alright, let's go check out Hello? this phone. Not there? Where are you, Missy? Don't 
you go missing on me as soon as you get married. You hear me? Better call me back at once, you know? Love you loads. See you soon. Alright. So we got a phone call apparently. Here. Oh, Easter Island statue. That's cool. Here's my goldfish. Wife's cooking up some. What? Where the fuck did she go? Where did she go? There's a turkey dinner. Alright. We'll go with that. Is there anything in here to... That looks suspicious. This. Our backyard. I don't know the uh, code to the safe there. Hey, there's my wife that keeps disappearing. Hey, get back here. Honey, where are you going? Oh, alright. It's like that, huh? Cool. No. She locked me out? You bitch. Fine. I guess I'll... The fuck is ringing at my front door? Chill, bro. Oh my god. You don't have to blow my shit up, man. What? I appear to be in a car wreck of sorts, on the ground, outside of the vehicle, some blood, this car, and I don't know how I got here, and I seem to have picked up a bottle and a lot of paper. I'm great, fine here, I've just been quite busy lately, and weren't able to write as much as I would have liked to. Happy to greet to hear about Jane. Really happy for her. As for the visit, it might not be possible. Okay, whatever. So apparently I need this bottle. This is my chucking bottle so I can see. Now we're into this world where I can either yell Rose or throw shit so that I can see. And it's absolutely fucking terrifying. Because I am in a 3D landscape that everything is black or a white outline. And maybe you've played this before, or maybe you haven't. Um, here's the blood trail. Um, but I know that there's enemies in here, and if they hear me, I die. And it's fucking terrifying. Uh, and you'll notice them in red. Red means danger. And you'll find more rocks, so you can pick them up and throw them in session. You want to just keep... Keep throwing rocks. So you can see where you're going. It appears that I've lost my rocks. Once they go in the water, I do not believe I can recover them. Um. Oh, I saved that one just in time. So talking is, you know, helpful. It is an option. Uh, but once I get in here, that's when it gets tricky. And I can swap to be very quiet.
that is dangerous. And if they hear me, I die. They are these crazy looking babies. And uh, I'm only gonna die once and I am done because it's honestly fucking It makes you hate making any noise in this game. Like. I don't want to die, I'm not going to lie. sound waves I'm throwing off, if the enemy catches them, I die. So sometimes it's best just to let shit go completely fucking dark. And me talking, they can hear that. My mic sets off noise just as much as throwing a rock. Watch, I'll be quiet. Watch this. Shut up. Yo, bitch! See? I can light up lots of shit with my voice. You want to keep as much lit up as you can. They're terrifying. They are. Thank you. 
Man, this game gets so intense. I'm trying not to die. I gotta make it out of here without... It was creepy as hell. I was like holding my breath just to not get caught. Now I'm down to one rock to throw. Or my voice. I don't want to talk though, because they can pinpoint you if you talk. If you're not talking, they can't. So, your best bet. Yo! It's not near me yet. Fuck! Give me some shit to throw. Can I throw that? No. Nope. I need weapons. Okay, so there's nothing here. There's something coming, though.
got me. They got me. I'm dead. That's it, man. I can't take any more of that. Thank you for watching. Y'all have a great fucking day. Until next time, have fun, stay kind, keep gaming. I'm out, y'all. Peace. I'll make you guys fucking awesome, man.